el tiempo pasado atrás. Let the past stay in the past. Bendito sea Jesús. Blessed be Jesus. Vamos a ir a la palabra de Dios. So we'll go into the word of God. En el libro de Éxodo. In the book of Exodus. En el capítulo 14, verso 3. Chapter 14, verses 13. Dice, pero Moisés dijo al pueblo, no temáis estar firmes y ve la salvación que el Señor hará hoy por vosotros, porque los egipcios a quienes habéis visto hoy no lo volveréis a ver jamás. It says, Moses answered the people, do not be afraid, stand firm and you will see the deliverance or the salvation the Lord will bring you today. The Egyptians you see today, you will never see again. Tell the person beside you. Deja el tiempo pasado atrás. Let the past stay in the past. Es el tema del mensaje. This is the theme of the message. Dios le está diciendo al pueblo de Israel a través de Moisés. So God is speaking to the people of Israel through Moses. Esto es eso que viste. And he's saying these Egyptians that you see today. No los volverás a ver jamás. You'll never see them again. Dios había decidido libertar al pueblo de Israel. God had already decided to set the people of Israel free. Y ahora ese poderoso ejército. And now this powerful army. Que en ese tiempo. Which in that time. Era el ejército más poderoso de la tierra. Was the most powerful army on earth. Ahora está hundido en el mar. Now they are drowned in the sea. Está ahogado. They are all drowned. Esto que ves. And he says, this book that you see, you will never see again. Because this stays in the past. Because this will be a history. And so we move forward. We move forward and, and towards the future. El futuro es algo que no podemos parar. And, and, and the future is something we can't stop or move forward, and, and, it, and it's impossible to prevent or to stop it. Consciente o inconsciente, usted está haciendo y se está moviendo el futuro. So whether you're conscious about it or unconscious about it, uh, even you're just sitting here, you're moving usted está forward moviendo, towards the future. Whether you're sleeping, está moviéndose en el futuro. You're still moving towards the future. Porque el reloj no para. Because time does not stop. Consciente o inconsciente, nos estamos moviendo. Conscious about it or not, we're moving forward to the future. Bendito sea Jesús. Blessed be Jesus. Y nuestro destino está en el futuro. And our destiny is in our future. Nuestros propósitos están en el futuro. Our purposes are in the future. Bendito sea el Señor. Blessed be the Lord. Nuestra visión, our mission, visión, our vision. Está en el futuro. Is in the future. Entonces nos estamos moviendo hacia el futuro. So we're moving towards the estamos future. Estamos viviendo en el presente hoy. Yeah, we're living in the present today. Y mientras nosotros nos movemos, and as we move forward, Dios se mueve con nosotros. God is moving with us. Bendito sea el Señor. Blessed be the Lord. Entre días, en menos de tres días, horas. En en tres días o menos de tres días, horas, tal vez. El año 2014, the year 2014, será historia. Will be a history. Historia personal suya. And it will be a personal history. Historia personal mía. It will be a personal history of my life. Historia en el calendario de la humanidad. It will be a history in the calendar of humanities. Of humanity's calendar. Dios ha decidido moverte hacia el futuro. But God has decided to move you forward into the future. ¿Por qué Dios ha decidido? And why has God decided this? Porque tiene vida. It's because you have life. Tiene vida. You have life. Y Dios ha decidido moverte hacia el futuro. And God has decided to move you into your future. Ahora el futuro es nuestro con el Señor. And so the future is ours in the Lord. El libro de Romanos capítulo 14 verso 8. En el book of Romans 14:8 dice la palabra del Señor. The word God states. Pues si vivimos para el Señor vivimos. If we live, we live to the Lord. 
Y si morimos para el Señor, morimos. And if we die, we die to the Lord. Por tanto, ya sea que vivamos o que muramos del Señor, somos. So, whether we live or die, we belong to the Lord. Dios nos ha dado vida en el tiempo. God has given us life within time. Cuando digo en el tiempo es como aquello que se puede medir con el reloj. And when I talk about time, it's, it's that thing that you can measure with the clock. Podemos medir los segundos. You can measure seconds. Los minutos. Minutes. Las horas. Hours. Los días. Los meses. Los años. Months, months and years. Pero también él se mueve con nosotros hacia la eternidad. But yet he, but he, he also moves with us into eternity. Por eso dice el apóstol Pablo acá. This is why the apostle Paul speaks here. Pues si vivimos para el Señor vivimos. ¿Cuánto estamos vivos? If, if we live, then we live to the Lord. And how many of us are alive? Sujetos a tiempo y a espacio. We are subject to time and space. Pero si morimos. But if we die, somos del Señor. We are of God. Transcendemos el tiempo. And so we transcend time. Y pasamos a la eternidad. And we pass into eternity. Con Dios. With God. ¿Cuánto bendicen a Dios? How many people are alive? Sea que vivamos, sea que muramos. So whether we live or we die, we belong to the Lord. Nos está esperando en el tiempo futuro. So the future is waiting for us. El Señor nos está esperando en el tiempo futuro. And God is waiting for us in that future. Time. El tiempo. It's in time. En el que se puede medir. In time which can be measured. Pero también se está moviendo. Nos está esperando en la eternidad. But He is also waiting for us in eternity. El pueblo de Israel. So the people of Israel Entró por disposición de Dios. entered because of the disposition of God. Escuche bien. He said, well, Entró por disposición de Dios. They entered because of God's disposition. A they entered into Egypt because it was God's will. Cuando José y sus hermanos y el padre llegaron a Egipto. When Joseph, his brothers, and his fathers came into Egypt. Tuvieron 430 años. They, had, they were there for 400, 430 years. Pero cuando Dios decide. But when God decides. Sacarlo de ahí. To bring them out of there. Por disposición de Dios. It was his will. Or his, his disposition. Sacarlo de nuevo de esa tierra. And so he took them out of that land. Dios has control de tu vida. So be, which means God Dios has control of their life. Tierra. And he was, he allowed to be born in this time and in this es time. De Dios. it is God's decision Soberanía de Dios. it's sovereignty que en este that you be este sitting lugar. here in this place today que tú te vivo. that you be alive que that you be breathing que that you can que jump that you can que tu corazón está that your heart be beating Así una de Dios. is God's will or his disposition esta tierra. as you enter into this este land planeta. and you live in this planet de Dios. it is God's will que vivas en este planeta that you live in this planet y que cumpla su propósito and that you fulfill his purposes y aquí, and that he will take you out of the way when he wants you denle un aplauso al Señor let's give our hand to the Lord déselo al Señor let's give it to the Lord it's not to you es grande hermanos it's something great brothers cosas que están totalmente en el control de Dios it's hey. things that are totally in God's control entonces Israel and so Israel at one point they're slaves but then God says I'm bringing them out and I'm going to take them out and nothing will detain this there is no stronghold there is no human stronghold there is no kind of stronghold that can detain this because it was God's purpose and his will blessed be Jesus December the 31st. Después de las 12, 12 de la noche. Once we reach 12 o'clock at night. Una milésima segundo después. Sí. A millisecond after that. Estamos en el año 2015. We are in the year 2015. Es una disposición de Dios. It is God's will. ¿Cuántos quieren llegar al 2015? Todavía no llegamos. We are not there yet. Todavía no llegamos. We are not there yet. ¿Cuántos creen que Dios tiene un futuro para su vida? How many believe that God has a future for your life? David creía que Dios tenía un futuro para él. They didn't believe that God had a future for him. Incluso le decía a Dios. And he even said to God, Dame vida para acabar. Give me life so I may worship you. ¿Para qué tú quieres vida? Why do you want life then? Te hago una pregunta, ¿para qué quieres vida? I ask you the question, why do you want life? ¿Para qué quieres vida? Why do you want it? Dice el apóstol Pablo, el tiempo que llevamos lo vamos a vivir en el Señor. Apostle Paul says, the time that we have, we're living in the Lord. Then why do you want life? God is a God of purposes. 
Entonces, quizás el año 2014 para muchos. And so maybe the year 2014 for many of us un año de dolor, un año de tristeza, was a year of pain and sadness, of bad things. Quizás de muchas cosas buenas también. And many, at the same time, many good things. Cosas que logramos y no logramos. Things that we, uh, were, we reached, things we were not able to do. Miramos que el pueblo de Israel, después de, de la muerte de los primogénitos, but then we see the people of Israel after the first were, uh, the first generation died. No, la muerte de los primogénitos en la plaga de Egipto. Sorry, after, after the, 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 the firstborn children died in the place in, in, in Egypt. Eso es el faraón dice, okay, vayas. And so all of a sudden, Pharaoh says, okay, leave. ¿Cuál era, cuál era el request? So then, what was the request? ¿Qué era lo que pedía Israel? What did Israel ask for? Deja mi pueblo libre para que me adore. He was saying, let my people go so they can go worship me. ¿Qué es lo que quiere Dios? What does God want? Oh. Que le adoremos, ah. that we worship him. Cuando el Señor nos rescata del mundo que representa Egipto y Faraón. So, when God rescues us from this world which is represented by Egypt and Pharaoh. ¿Para qué te liberta Dios? Why do you think he set you free? Para que le adoremos. So that you can come and worship. Bendito sea Jesús. Blessed be Jesus. Pero en su corazón se arrepiente Faraón. But in his heart then all of a sudden Pharaoh repents. ¿Por qué dejamos ir a los Egipcios? And he's thinking why are we leaving all the Israelites go? Si lo necesitamos. We need them. Todos los que nos hacían las construcciones. They're the ones that constructed everything for us. Ahora ya se fueron, ya no los tenemos. Now they're gone, we no longer have them. Y arma una fuerza poderosa. And all of a sudden, he, he puts an army together. 600 army, carros. 600 chariots. Los mejores soldados. The best soldiers. Y a seguir a Israel. And they go and persecute Israel. Una fuerza formidable. It's a strong, it's a force coming. Va a querer parar a 600 mil personas. And they want, to, they want to stop more than 600,000 people que van por el desierto. that are walking through the desert. El diablo no te quiere soltar. But the devil doesn't want el to let you go. Faraón. He is the Pharaoh. Te quiere mantener esclavizado. And he wants to have you as a slave. Cuando el Israel estaba en Egipto. So when Israel was in Egypt, construyendo, they were constructing a building. Había capataces. Capataces, un forma. There was a, a, the foreman, the ones that were at the head in control. Y cuando iban a trabajando despacio los israelitas, and los hebreos. Once the Israelites were, were working and they, and they started working slow. Agarraban un látigo. And they grabbed a whip. Y lo latigaban. And they whipped them. Eran esclavos. They were slaves. Tenían sus hijos. They had their children. Faraón dio una orden. And Pharaoh gave an order. Laten a todos los niños. Kill all the boys. Solo dejen vivir las niñas. Let the girls live. El diablo no está contento con que te escapaste. But the devil's not happy that you escaped. Y entonces manda sus fuerzas. So he sends a strong hope. Y te quiere regresar. And he wants to pull you back. Tal vez has llegado hasta este día. And maybe you come here till today. Vivo. Alive. Casi te mueres. And almost you probably este died. In this year, 2014. And it may be a, a bad movement that you made. Una maniobra en el carro. Maybe you did a bad movement. You were like you're driving almost. Algo pasó. Right. Something happened. Pero estás aquí. But yet you're here today. Ha sufrido situaciones. And we've suffered so many situations. Quizá el diablo te latigó. And maybe the devil came and whipped you. Con desprecio. With despisement. Con soledad. With a solidarity. Con tristeza. With sadness. Con depresión. With depression. Y está por salir de este año. And you're about to leave this year. El año 2014 fue un año duro. You might say 2014 was so hard. Que te moría. And you felt like you're about to die. Y el diablo no quiere que te vayas. The devil does not want to let you go. Y lo quiero traer. And he wants to pull you back. Y lo quiero traer de nuevo. And he wants to have you as a slave. Lo quiero traer a los vicios. He wants to bring you back into the addictions. Lo quiero llevar que se arrastre en el mundo. And he wants to bring you back so you can go and throw yourself out of the window. Y prepara sus mejores soldados. And so he prepares his best soldiers. Y a veces los mejores soldados que ocupa el día no son tus mejores amigos. And sometimes the best soldiers of the devil prepares for you as your best friends. Que te digan, vení, vamos. And they tell you, come on, let's go. Hagamos lo malo. Let's go do the bad things. Dice la palabra, si los pecadores se sientan engañados. Estos sinners came and tried to deceive you. No lo consientas. Don't listen. No lo permitas. Don't allow it. El enemigo te va a querer volver hacia atrás. The enemy will come and he'll try to pull you back. Pero si usted te me servía. But you see, you might say, he served me before. Santo. Antes de él le adoraba con sus acciones. And he might say, you know, that he worshiped you with his actions. Ahora ya no me quiere servir. And 
Now he no longer Yo no quiero el regreso. Pero el Señor ha dispuesto a sacar de Egipto. Egypt, el Señor ha dispuesto a pasarla para la conquista. Y es mi victoria. Es bendición. En blessing. Porque Dios está trabajando a tu favor. Favor. Bendito sea Jesús. Blessed be Jesus. So they were there for more than 400 years as slaves in Egypt. Abrir los ojos. And for them to open up their eyes. Bajo un reino faraónico. They kept opening up their eyes under a kingdom. Apenas empezas a hablar y a oír. And as soon as you begin to, y a entender, to speak and to hear and to understand. Todo lo que se oye de faraón. Everything that you hear within the kingdom is Pharaoh. Todo circula sobre faraón. Everything is surrounded in Pharaoh. The statues created. Los edificios. The buildings. Le dan gloria a Faraón. They give glory to Pharaoh. Hay una cultura de esclavitud. And so there was a culture of slavery in that place. Nacimos esclavos. And so they say I was born as a slave. Mi abuelo era esclavo. My grandfather was a slave. Yo soy esclavo. I'm a slave. Mi hijo será esclavo. My children then will be slaves. Pero Dios decide. But God decides. Mi pueblo. My people. Va a ser esclavo más. They will no longer be slaves. Mi pueblo será libre. My people will be set free. Yo determino sacar. Blessed be Jesus. Hay personas que en el año 2014, and there are people in the year 2014, en los primeros meses, in the first years, en los meses del verano, or, or sometimes in the summer months, y aún todavía en estos últimos días, and even here at the last months of the year, se quedaron retenidos por Faraón. The devil came and he grabbed them and he detained them. The Pharaohs came and detained them. Algunos estuvieron aquí en la iglesia, and some were here at church. Pero ya no están. But they're no longer here. Lo agarró el enemigo. And then he grabbed the hook. Y lo volvió para atrás. And took him backwards. Y allá están afuera. And they are outside. Viéndole. Serving him. Al diablo. Serving the devil. Cuando Dios había determinado. But God had determined. Bendecimos. To bless them. No se aflija por las circunstancias que estamos viviendo. No. Don't be afflicted by the situations we're living. No se aflija por la situación que estás pasando. Don't be afflicted no. or worried for the situations you're living. Mira lo que dijeron los, los israelitas. Listen to what the Israelites said. Cuando miran a Faraón que viene sobre ellos. When they see Pharaoh coming up against them and all his army. Yeah. No había sepulcros en Egipto. And they said, weren't there tombs over there in, in, in Egypt? ¿Por qué mejor no nos morimos allá? Why didn't we just stay there and die there? Dios ha determinado para ti que no te vas a morir en tierra de Faraón. God has determined you will not die in the land of Pharaoh. Service. She was directing the service. 
As she was directing the service, she died in front of everyone. A woman of God, but God had decided He was going to take her that day. So you can't count with the future. No me quiero contradecir, no quiero que me malentienda. I don't want to contradict what I'm saying and I don't want you to misunderstand. En reloj, usted cuenta con el hoy. And in the time that we have, we come with today. En Cristo, usted cuenta con mañana. But in Christ, we come with for tomorrow. Y ya se lo voy a decir por qué. And I'll tell you why. Hebreo 13, 8. Hebrews 13, 8. Dice, Jesucristo es el mismo ayer. It says, Jesus Christ is the same. Yes, es el mismo hoy. It's the same today. Y por los siglos. Yes, the same forever. Si estoy en Cristo. So if I'm in Christ. Jesucristo estuvo conmigo ayer. That, that means Jesus Christ was with me yesterday. ¿Cuántos cuánto estuvieron con el Señor ayer? How many were with God yesterday? Jesucristo está conmigo hoy. ¿Cuántos tienen a Jesús hoy? So Jesus Christ with me today. Who has Christ today? Today. En el tiempo contable, si vivo mañana estoy con Jesús. In, our, in, our, in the time that we live in, if I live tomorrow, then tomorrow I'll be with Jesus. Pero si yo muero, hoy, but if today I die, ya el no para mí then, no, time, no se me then tomorrow time will longer count yo for me eternidad. because I am now living in eternity. Y en esa within that eternity, Dice, y él es por los de los he is forever. Está de la He's talking about eternity. So it means with the Lord. Si estoy con el Señor, if I'm in the Lord. Ayer estuve con él. Yesterday I was with him. Hoy está con nosotros. Today I'm with him. Y en la eternidad. And I'll be with him for eternity. Nosotros. He's with us. Porque él mismo ayer, hoy y siempre. siempre. And forever. Bendito sea Jesús. Blessed be Jesus. No todo el mundo tiene esa oportunidad. And no. everybody has this opportunity. Son un pueblo especial. We are a special people. Son un pueblo singular. A people that's Está en Cristo lo mejor. Usted la tiene asegurada. You have everything to I'm sure. Si usted no tiene a Cristo, but if you don't have Christ, usted no tiene nada. You have nothing. Y puede tener muchas cosas. You might have many things. Pero sin Cristo, but without Christ, usted no tiene nada. You have nothing. Asegúrese de tener a Cristo. Be assured. Asegúrese de Christ. Be assured that you have Christ. Bendito sea Jesús. Quiero con este mensaje ayudar a que usted se extienda hacia adelante. So I want with this message that you extend yourself forward. Olvídese de que lo que pasó ayer. Forget what happened yesterday. Lo que este año le dejó, que quizás usted tuvo un año difícil. Maybe you had a difficult year. Pero el Señor no quiere que te vivas en el pasado. But God doesn't want you to live in the past. Él quiere que tú vivas en el futuro con él. He wants you to live also in the future with him. Mira que la Biblia solo está llena de promesas. Have you noticed that the Bible is full of promises? Jesucristo cuando está acá. When Jesus was here. Dios en la casa de mi padre muchas moradas. He says in, in my father's house there are many dwelling places. Me voy pues a preparar que el futuro. So I go to prepare you your future. Está hablando del futuro. He's talking about the future. Le dijeron los discípulos, ustedes ya conocen el camino. He told the disciples, you already know the way. Señor, ¿cómo si nosotros no conocemos el camino? But he, they said, Lord, how? We don't know the way. Eso le dijo, yo soy el camino. He said to them, I am the way. Y donde yo esté, where I am, quiero que usted esté donde esté. I want you to also be. Y si él habita en la eternidad, if he inhabits eternity, yo habitaré en la eternidad también. I will also inhabit eternity with him. Denle un aplauso al Señor. Usted lo tiene asegurado. You have that assurance. Usted no tiene que tener miedo. You have, you shouldn't be afraid. Lo que no tiene a Cristo es lo que tiene el miedo. Bendito sea Jesús. Blessed be Jesus. Gracias, Señor. Quizás Faraón te ha robado los mejores años de tu vida. And maybe Pharaoh came and stole the best years of your life. Quizás la negligencia. Maybe because of negligence. Ha sido tu Faraón. Maybe negligence has become your fear in your life. Y te sientes quizás hoy fracasado o fracasada. And maybe today you might feel a, as a failure or that you failed. Porque has sido negligente con los años que Dios te ha dado. Because you've been negligent with the years which God has given you. Con la vida que Dios te ha otorgado. With the life that He's given you. Pero viene un mañana. But tomorrow comes. 
y en el nombre de Jesús echa fuera la negligencia. And in the name of Jesus, you throw out that negligence. Y tú dices, en el año 2015, yo voy a ser una persona diligente. I will be a very diligent person. Yo voy a ser una persona diligente. 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 Yo voy a ser una persona trae un problema espiritual because for many negligence un problema familiar and it brings you a spiritual problem a family problem un problema en su liderazgo espiritual a problem in your leadership un problema en su casa a problem in your home porque hay mucha gente que espera de ti hay una demanda because there are many people waiting for you de que hagas sal and there's a demand over you for you to be sal bendito sea el nombre de Jesús blessed be the name of Jesus ¿Quieres llevar la negligencia al año 2015? You want to carry negligence with you to the year 2015? Dejar todo para el mañana? Do you want to leave everything for tomorrow? O lo quiere, o quieres que Dios la haga, dile al Señor, ahoga la negligencia en el mar rojo. Or do you want God to come and drown your negligence in the red sea? Que se quede la negligencia ahogada, que no pase conmigo. So that that negligence stays in that sea, it doesn't cross your promised land. Your promised land. Gente que vive amargada y vive amargado toda la vida. And there are people who live a bitter life and they live their whole life in bitterness. Vive amargado en 2014. They were bitter in 2014. Y ahí vienen con su gran mochila de amargura. Ah, para 2015. Ahora en el mar rojo. Y yo te rompa en el Red Sea en el nombre de Jesús. Que señora la ahogue ahí. No pasa. Because the Lord is drowned. Don't take it with you. Y cuando la mires ahogada afuera. And when you see it drowned in the Red Sea. La hogada dice que el pueblo de Israel miró a los egipcios. So the people of Israel saw the Egyptians, the soldiers. Ahogados. They were all drowned. A la orilla del mar. At the at the shores. Y cantaron a Dios. So they sang to the Lord. They blessed the Lord. Porque los que los tenían cautivos morían. Estaban ahí muertos. Those that had them captive were now there. Cuando pasa el 2015. And so as we pass into 2015. Mira la negligencia. Look into negligence. Mira la fornicación. Look at your fornication. Look at your adultery. Mira la pereza. Look at that that being lazy. Mira la borrachera. Look at your drunkenness. Todo eso está ahí. And all of that. Gracias a Dios. 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 En los ejércitos, cuando hay guerra. So the armies and when they're at war. Si alguien se corre, if one of the soldiers runs, lo fusilan. They shoot him. En la Biblia, in the Bible, está prohibido que usted se corra. It's prohibited that you run. ¿Sabe usted eso? Did you know this? Cuando David escogía hombres para el ejército, when David came and he chose people for his army. Escogía solo valientes. He chose the courageous, the valiant. Y el apóstol Pablo, inspirado por el Espíritu Santo, dice que no te ha dado espíritu de cobardía. And the apostle Paul, inspired by the Holy Spirit, says that he has not given you a spirit of power, of power, espíritu de poder, or timid, to timid, to be timid, but he's giving you a spirit of power, un espíritu de dominio propio, a spirit of self-control. Antes de conquistar la tierra, and so before you come to conquer the land, Dios le dijo, Josué. God spoke to Joshua. He says, "Look, I'm calling you. Be strong, courageous. Be strong, courageous. Tell the person beside you, be courageous. And repeat it. Be courageous." Jesús dijo, Jesús said, el que poniendo la mano en el arado, the one who puts his hands on the plow, and looks back, ¿cuál es el plan atrás? El pasado. It means looking back at the past. I want you to be looking at the past. The Bible says that you have to extend yourself to the things that are behind.
relationship with me and one of the biggest sins that people will be lost because of it. Some people, they always yes, yeah. people will be lost because they blaspheme or speak against them with spirit and it's true. Pero muchos se van a perder por cobardes. But many will be lost because they are cowards. Porque dejan a Cristo. Because they leave Christ aside. Porque se quedan atrás. Because they go back. Porque quieren vivir con Faraón. They want to live with Pharaoh. Porque quieren vivir con el pecado. Because they want to live with their sin. Dios te ha llamado. But God has called you. Hacia el frente. To move forward. A ser un valiente. And to be courageous. Sabes que quieren dar cobardía y Dios me ha dado espíritu de valor. So if yo soy un valiente. If you're a coward, it's most likely. Si Dios te ha dado espíritu de valor. And if God has chosen you, that means you are courageous. Bendito sea Jesús. You're valiant. Blessed be the Lord. Todo por terminar porque el tiempo se nos va rápido. About to finish. Time is up. Jesús mismo hablando. So Jesus Christ himself speaking. Dice, acuérdese de la mujer de lo que vio en para atrás. He said, remember. Uh, Lot's wife who looked back. ¿Qué pasó con la mujer de lo que vio para atrás? What happened with his wife when she looked backwards? Después de que Dios la libertó, after God has set her free, me saca del incendio, and and he he brought them out of that place of judgment. Se saca del centro de juicio. He brings God out of that center of judgment. El Señor te ha sacado del reino de Satanás. And the Lord has come and he's brought you out of the kingdom of Satan, out of the kingdom of darkness. And he has brought you to the kingdom of his beloved son. And the angels told him, do not look back. But the woman turns around and looks back. It's prohibited to look backwards. Jesus is saying it. In Luke 17, 32, acordado de la mujer de Lord. In Luke 17, 32. It says, remember Lot's wife. Jesus in that verse says, remember Lot's wife. Why? It is prohibited to look back. And we're talking about all those things in the past. That, that Pharaoh, tú, Pharaoh had for you and, 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 and he, he, that he retained over you and, 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 and you, be, you became accustomed to, my, de Pharaoh, to the culture of Pharaoh entrando, y en la del reino de Dios. and now we're walking and moving into the kingdom of God we're moving into eternity Vamos, ha dado tiempo, el Señor. and so God has given us a time y un tiempo corto. and it is a short time porque la vida de nosotros es muy corta. La Biblia lo repite, lo repite, lo repite. Es so short, and the Bible repeats it over and over again. Estos jóvenes que están acá, these young men that are here, en 20 años serán unos viejos. In 20 years, they'll be old. No creas que van a vivir jóvenes toda la vida. Don't believe you'll be young forever. No se engañe. Don't be deceived. Quiera o no, el tiempo te empuja. Whether you push it or not, time is pushing you forward. Quiera o no, el pelo se vuelve blanco. Whether you like it or not, you're going to get gray hair. Esos cuerpitos de sirena de las muchachas. Those beautiful bodies that these girls have. Se acaban. They'll no longer be there. Hay los muchachos haciendo ejercicio. But you have these young men doing their exercise and getting strong. But as you get into an old age, it's all over. The Bible says that the world is pleasure they pass. This that you see will pass. The pleasures that you are, 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 are living in today will pass. But the one who stands in the word, the one who stands in Christ, this will live forever. Let's give a hand to the Lord. Thank you for joining us. Thank you for joining us. And here we have parents telling their children, don't look back. And there's a Lord speaking through the Holy Spirit, don't look back. And there's the pastor telling you, did you know that there are people sitting here and they don't like you? They don't like me. But I don't care. I don't care. Do you know why? Because 
Ecclesiastes chapter 2 states que la palabra de los pastores son como clavos metidos en las congregaciones that the words of the pastors are like nails driven into the congregation Ay, me está, and you're like oh, oh, sistema, yo no quiero que oh, esté hablando de esto talking about certain things that I don't like him when he talks about those things y entonces les cae mal este mensaje and so some people don't like these messages les cayó mal lo que dijo Jesús and they don't like what Jesus said Dice que muchos andaban con él. And it says that many were with him. Pero de momento vivían, muchos se fueron. But all of a sudden they were all gone. Y dijeron, dura esta palabra. And they said, your word is hard. Y Jesús dijo, mira, se van a ellos. And the Lord said to them, look, they're leaving. Los discípulos dijeron, mira, se van a ellos. And he said to the disciples, look, they're leaving. Jesús dijo, si quieren ir And he said to them, do you want to go with them? La palabra nos confronta. And so the word of God will confront us. Pero es vida eterna. But it is eternal yeah. life. Es vida eterna. It is eternal. Hay gozo. And there is joy. Yes. And there is peace. Hay seguridad. And there is security. Hay confianza. And, there is, and you have to be confident. You, you have to be confident. Cuando uno está en Cristo. Camina en el Señor. That when you are in Christ and you walk in the Lord. Ya sabe, yo sé si me muero para donde voy. And I know. If no I tengo nada. If I die, yo sé por dónde voy. I know where I'm going. Y me esfuerzo por estar en el camino del Señor. So I make an effort to walk in the ways of the Lord. Y tengo confianza. And I'm confident. Y usted debe tener confianza. And you need to be confident as well. Se sufre en los caminos del Señor. Do we suffer when we walk in the ways of the Lord? Yes, we suffer. Miren la tremenda victoria. But look at the great victories. Todos los, los egipcios ahogados. All the Egyptians were drowned. Y ahora le dice, bueno, vamos para acá y se nos. And so Moses says, we're going this way. Caminan tres días. And so they walk for three days. Y no hay agua. And there's no water. El burro no tiene agua. The donkey has no water. El caballo no tiene agua. La oveja no tiene agua. The horse is thirsty. El caballo no tiene agua. The sheep no water. Los niños no tienen agua. The children have no water. Los ancianos no tienen agua. The elderly have no water. Y es un lugar donde hay aguas. And so they come into a place where there's water. Pero las aguas son amargas. Yet the water is bitter. Ahora, ellos no saben que si en tres días van a hallar agua. And now they don't know that if within three days they're about to find water. Yo he estado en el desierto y sé cómo se siente el desierto. I've been in the desert and I know how it feels like. Ni un árbol. There's no trees. Caliente, las rocas calientes. It's hot and the rocks are hot. Tres días. But for three days. No hay agua. They had no water. ¿Y cómo es que este Dios está grande? Acaba de matar a los hijos y aquí estamos con ustedes nosotros. So they're murmuring. How is it that this God is so great? He killed the Egyptians, but we have no water. Tranquilo, es el Dios. But Moses says, relax. Agarró un pedazo de palo, lo echó en el agua. Took a piece of wood or stick, threw it into the water. Y las aguas se volvieron dulces. And all of a sudden, the waters became sweet. La Biblia repite constantemente, constantly repeats sobre la trayectoria del pueblo de Israel. Upon the trajectory of Israel, their journey. Es para ver qué había en el corazón de ellos. And it was to show and to reveal what was in their heart. Quizá la prueba del año 2014. Maybe the trials of 2014. La batalla que está viviendo. Las luchas que está viviendo. The trials, the struggles you live. Dios quiere ver que si de veras lo amas. Maybe God really truly wants to see if you truly love Him. Porque después de que salen de las aguas de Mara. Because after they leave those waters, Mara. Llegan a un lugar. They come to a place. A Elim. To Elim. Donde hay setenta palmeras. Where there's seventy palms. Doce fuentes de agua. And twelve fountains of water. Una fuente para cada tribu. There was a fountain for each tribe. Abundantes aguas. There was an abundance of water. Después de la prueba. After the trial. Viene la bendición. Comes the blessing. Dios te está esperando. God is waiting. Ya está en el otro lado. Ya está en el año 2015. Ya está en el año 2015. Cargado de bendición. And he's carrying all these. Blessings, pero con un propósito. But it is with a purpose, para que le adore. So that we may worship him. Puedo decir que le gusta el Dios. Quisiera seguir predicando, pero no puedo. I would like to be preaching, but my time is up. Cuánto bendice a Dios. Amén.
Yo quiero que usted sea valiente. And I want you to be valiant. El Señor quiere que sea valiente. God wants you to be courageous. A ver cuánto van a pasar a dejar las mochilas hoy aquí. So let's see how many people come up and leave their baggage here. No era antes del pastor. No era antes del pastor. It's not for me. Delante de Dios. But it's before God. Entonces esta mochila la dejo aquí. You say I'm leaving this backpack. Yo esto lo dejo aquí. Yo no paso por la. No tengo nada por él. To 2015 with all my baggage. Hay cosas que te han de retenir y detener. Hay cosas que te han de retenir y detener. No pase al otro lado. But don't go into the following year. Dios mío, aquí está aquí el entierro. With all that baggage, you tell the Lord, this is where I bury it. This is where it is drowned in the sea. Aquí la hundo delante de tu presencia. I will drown in your presence. Comienza a hablar con el Señor. Begin to speak with the Lord. Si no tienes ese espíritu, lo tienes el espíritu de valentía. You have the spirit of to be courageous. Porque sí dice la Biblia que nos ha dado ese espíritu. The Bible says that He has given us the spirit. Y ore al Señor. And pray to God de que ese espíritu that, that spirit, se mueva poderosamente en tu vida. Move in a powerful way in your life. Y aunque no tiene a Jesús, the one who does not have Jesus, es el más pobre que hay aquí en la tierra. They are the poorest people here on earth. Hey, hermano, no me importa los millones que usted tenga, sí. lo bonito que sea, y el carro que tenga, the cars that you have, usted es un pobre miserable. Así dice la Biblia. Así dice la Biblia. Un pobre miserable. Así dice la Biblia. Así dice la Biblia. Pobre y miserable. Jesucristo dijo: Jesús Cristo dijo: Sin mí nada soy, que nada sé. Cero, ni ser, nothing. Sin mí nada soy. Dice: Without me you're nothing. Fuera de mí, and outside of me, nada puedes hacer. You can do nothing. Hay alguien que diga: Yo quiero a Jesús. Is there someone that can say, I want Jesus? Quiero tenerlo todo, and I want to have it all. Porque lo tienes a Jesús, lo tienes todo. Sí, así es. Toca espíritu. Hay promesas grandes para tu vida. There are great promises for your life. Herederos y coherederos con Cristo. You are inheritors and coherders with Christ. Promesa. Jesús dijo. Jesus Christ said. Que el que él venía iba a dar vida. Y vienen a abundarse. Lo que más desea la gente es vida. What people want the most here is life. Quiere vida la gente. They want life. Pero eso dijo, yo tengo vida. But Jesus Christ said, I have life. No limitar. And it's not limited. Vida en abundancia. Life in abundance. Vida eterna en mí. Eternal life in me. Este es el Señor de Sabía. It's in God. Así es. Pero es tu decisión. Amén. Gloria a Dios. Es tu decisión. Habrá alguien que yo quiero Sabía. Yo quiero caminar con Jesús. I want to walk with Jesus. O quieres seguir tu camino, o do you want to continue in your ways? Un faraón, un faraón, que clavisa tu vida. Who is making you a slave? Habrá que valer que quiero orar por esa persona. Si quiero entregar mi vida a Jesús, primera vez que quiero reconciliar, vas a orar por ti. Amén, Gloria a Dios. Hay un futuro glorioso para mí. Hay una bendición de Dios. Hay una bendición de Dios. Hay una bendición de Dios. Bendito sea Jesús. Vamos a orar. Jesus, we'll pray. Vamos a entregar toda, toda la carga de acá. Vamos a dejar todo lo que nos ha dedicado.